Hi guys, it's Regina, and I'm back with another kit, and this is the Serendipity line by k and Company. And so it includes 12 pieces of the um, papers. So these are the papers, and I've already gone ahead and die cut them using the scallop die and also the square die. That's a really pretty collection. This one has the um, glitter. And on this one, I use the Tattered Angels Butterfly Glimmer Screen as well as the stamp over it. And um, I've used the Suede Glimmer Mist. And then in the center of the butterfly, I use the Rock Candy Stickles. And then these are the chip pieces that you're going to get, and they're all medium weight chipboard. So you're going to get this frame, and you're also going to get this frame. And then you're going to get three of the scallop and three of the square. And then you're going to get the alphabet A through Z. So you get all of those letters. And then for the flowers, these two right here are by American Crafts. And then the rest are all Prima. And these are the Prima E-Line. And then you're going to get that big Prima one. Really pretty. And then you're going to get two of these huge brads. Really nice. And two of the Tim Holtz fragment charms. And you can add photos underneath those or you can stamp on them. You're going to get this butterfly. Really pretty. This Tim Holtz trinket pin. The Tim Holtz swivel clasp. So you can dangle that butterfly from that. And this is a Making Memories piece. Really cute. And I'm also going to give you a, um, I think it's called Hitch Fastener. So I was thinking that it would be cute to make this piece, like for the cover, to make it a door. And this could be like the pull on it. Really cute. And then you're going to get these bling pieces. And these are nice. I love to put these in the center of the flowers. And these shine really nice. And you're going to get two of these stick pins. And one is a heart and the other one's just like a ball. Cute. And you're going to get seven of the extra large eyelets in copper. Really cute. And then I'm also including two photo turns with the brads that go in the center. And then these are all the die cuts you'll be getting. And the other kit will be a little bit different, but everything coordinates. And they're really cute die cuts for this line. This one says Dream. I love this one. This is really cute. And then you'll get this piece. This one says Time Together. And this one says Family. And you'll get these butterflies. And they shine really, really nice. And you'll get these uh, stickers. It says Laugh Out Loud, Our Story, True Love. Once Upon a Time, Our Adventure, Best Friends, Capture the Moment. Really cute. And then I'm also including all of these um, little die cut punches. So this one's a scallop. And these are the Stampin' Up! tabs. And this one also you fold it in half and it's like a pull. And the Modern Label Punch. And this one. That looks like the top note shape. Cute. And I love this piece to hang 
like from the inside of the mini. Cute! And so I've gone ahead and sprayed it with Glimmer Mist, the pearl. Oh, there you go. Now you can see it. And I stamped the bird cage and the bird. And then I applied the pink stickles just around along the edge of the bird cage. And then on top of the bird, I put the matte accents, not the glossy accents, the matte. And I like how it came out. It's my first time using it. And then over the bird cage, I put some rock candy stickles. So this is really nice. I love this piece. And then on the back, I used the Tattered Angels journaling stamp. So that way you can journal on the back. Cute. Love it. And then uh, you can attach this to your mini. Usually I put this on the back. I love this. This is a Tattered Angels stamp as well. And it says handcrafted by. And then you can just sign your name in the middle. And then there's just some extra pieces. So what I like to do is I like to glue it on top of the chipboard just to uh, give dimension to it. And then I've also die cut this envelope and stamped on it and added glimmer mist and then inked up the edges. And I used my uh, stamp that says pull and then you can pull it out. And I stamped that little flourish stamp and this is perfect for some journaling. Really cute. And it just tucks right back in there. And this is another one that I love. Your very own postcard. And again, I added stickles. I am loving, loving the shine. So in the center, I used the pink. And then for the petals, I used the turquoise. Look how cute that is. And then I stamped postcard. And uh, this is also a stamp of a stamp and then I just sprayed it with the wheat fields glimmer mist. So I'm loving this kit. A lot of fun. Looks like it'll be a lot of fun to put together and then you also get the little bird and I ran him through the embossing folder and he's also sprayed with um, glimmer mist, the iridescent gold. And then you'll get two of the shipping tags that you can alter yourself you'll get the file folder and you'll also get the scallop envelope by Stampin' Up and then I love this this is the super crescent tag and I use my embossing folder my Cuddlebug embossing folder um, that looks like a journal and so you can journal on it and that's why I included seven of the extra large eyelets so then you can set one here and um, at the top and then it just tucks into this pocket envelope that I die cut out of vellum and it's pink vellum really pretty I think it goes perfect with the line and then there's just a square piece you can put it inside for the journaling of the uh, scallop envelope and then the last thing you'll be getting are um, these pieces. So this ribbon is cut at 14 inches. Really pretty. And you'll also get the branch. Cute. And then these fiber pieces. Everything coordinates really well. I love these. I love how they fade. They go from light to dark. Really cute. This one's sparkly. This one's the white one. Really nice. And the turquoise. And the brown. And this one has the brown and the green. And this one is pink, and the dark pink. And then the last piece you'll get is the tool, because I love adding tool to my projects. So that's my kit, guys. Like I said, I have two available, so thanks for watching, and be sure to check out my Etsy store.